I'm Erin, I'm Sarah and I'm a volunteer, I've been volunteering um, for about two and a half years now and for the last year I've been doing skills based volunteering. In skills based volunteering we work with the person with a disability on an issue that they've identified or they've identified with staff um, to learn a new skill or to reach a particular goal but maybe staff haven't got time to do with them and that's where the skill based volunteer comes in. Erin had a little bit of difficulty choosing the right outfits to wear and particularly when she was packing to go and stay with her family. So um, Brenda who's the volunteer coordinator and myself and Erin sat down to talk about how we might help with that and we came up with the idea of having a folder that had photographs of Erin in all her outfits and, and placing them in you know, outfits that she would wear to go out or outfits she wears every day and that Erin could look through and choose and it was actually Erin that came up with the name Starfile and we just thought oh that's just such a brilliant name so that's how that came about. Oh, find is good to look at my file and look at my pictures and then I can pack everything to my suitcase and that's feel fine I can do that. Did you mind that it was only for a few weeks? Was that okay? Yeah. Just to do it for, what do we did it for about six weeks I suppose. Yeah. Yeah, I definitely recommend skills-based volunteering. It's great for the variety, it just gets you to see lots of different people. I mean, sometimes it's hard to move on. You feel like, oh, you work with that person, you think, oh, I'd really like to work more with this person, but you have to think, no, this is, I've done my little bit and now it's time to move on to, to somebody else. Yeah. Thank you, Sarah. Oh, you're very welcome. It's been really enjoyable, and I always say about volunteering that you get back more than you give, really.